Well, hello, and thank you for joining me for another Alex on Tech and ITY TV interview. I'm joined today by Jamie Lang Reese. She's the head of product management Australia and New Zealand at Belkin International. Welcome to the program. Hi, Alex. Thank you so much for taking the time to chat with me today. It's going to be great to chat all things Belkin and tech. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks for taking the time as well. So uh, I'd be surprised if anybody watching doesn't know Belkin, considering especially that it's Belkin's 40th year of operation. But uh, just in case, can you please tell us about Belkin as we record this in March 2023? Absolutely. Um, so yes, it is our 40 year anniversary, anniversary, which is something we're super proud of. Um, Belkin is an accessories market leader um, in the CE industry. Um, you know, we play in multiple different categories, including power, protection, connectivity, audio, which is a newer one for us, mm -hmm. and security. Yeah. Um, you know, all of our all of our products are de designed in um, Southern California, uh, and we are available in over 50 countries around the world. What are the most popular products uh, this year so far, I guess, leading in from Christmas last year? And what are those security products? I'm, I'm curious now. Yeah, absolutely. Um, we we develop so many products um, in so many different categories, as I mentioned. Um, but I think some of our most popular products in the last 12 months have probably been our MagSafe three-in-one solutions. Mm. I actually have a couple of them here that I can I can pick up and show you if that yep. if that helps. Mm -hmm. um, but we've got a couple of different designs. We've got a stand design and a flat lay design, which I'm showing you here which is a bit more travel friendly. Mm. Um, and for those consumers that are heavily embedded in the Apple ecosystem, it really, it, it's a great solution. It enables them to charge all of their devices, including their phone, their watch, and their wireless charging AirPods, all in one seamless experience. Yeah, I've got um, a couple of the stands and um, the, the yeah. flat would be much more travel friendly, but those ones travel very well too, very handy. Absolutely. Um, but. In terms of those security products that you were you were just asking about, we're really talking about secure KVMs there, which is um, you know security uh, uh, technology that enables uh, for air gaps between different networks, so that um, secure networks are able to remain secure and not have uh, uh, leakage over from one network to the other. Um, so. We're really heavily embedded um, in, you know, government departments and things like that, where they utilize this kind of technology um, for their networks. Yeah, I, get, I bet that's something that a lot of Belkin customers don't know. And if they're in business or government, and now they do. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> now, two new products uh, that came out, I saw the one particular one, which I'm using right now, launched in the Apple keynote, I think, uh, like a year ago. But that's the Belkin iPhone MagSafe mount for macbooks and you've also subsequently then released one for the mac desktops uh, and it's ingenious i mean it's also a um, like a pop socket type of arrangement where you can put your finger through and grip it and it's a yep. stand but you've also got the ability as i'm doing right now to pop it on the top of your mac so uh, can you please show us the unit and explain why it's such a revelation yeah absolutely i can so we've got i've got one here mm -hmm. they come in both black and in white yep. um and Ultimately, they're really thoughtfully designed so that consumers can use uh, the full functionality of their Apple device and use their phone ultimately as their webcam, um, utilizing the continuity camera. Um, so they're MFI certified, so they're, they're made for um, uh, MagSafe, um, which is great because then consumers know that they're getting a really quality product that is gonna function the way that they expect. Um, but they also, as you mentioned, which is one of my favorite features, is the ring grip and the kickstand. So I use this currently on my phone um, so that I can use it as like a viewing tool and, and just to hold my phone as sure. well. And, and just hold it up and uh, show us, and you've got to hold it in front of yourself because we blurred the background, but on, on the back of your phone, just pull the little yeah. uh, clip down, the one that clips onto the top of your... Absolutely. Yeah, so push that one in. That, that, and just Yeah, push so there, that. Yeah. There is the little clip there. Yeah. And that, that's that what sits out. on top of the on top of the uh, the lid of your yeah. laptop or on the top of your Mac. Yeah, simple and easy. Yeah. Very simple, <laughs> very simple, but very effective. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, so you mentioned MagSafe products. I looked at the website. There's a whole stack there. Tell us a little bit about some of the other ones in the range. Uh, we we have a plethora of MagSafe um, solutions. Um, we obviously work really closely with Apple. We, they, we have a great partnership with them. Um, we have a lot of um, charging solutions that utilize this technology. 
But some of the other products that I would probably want to talk to you about outside of our MagSafe solutions um, would be in our audio category. I, I mentioned earlier, this is a category that we've more recently gotten into um, and it's really, really exciting for us. Um, and we're, we're developing a great range of solutions that our consumers are really, really loving. Um, one of my favorites is something I've also got here that I can show you is our kids um, over-ear true uh, or wireless headphones. Um, so these are decibel limited so that they're really safe for um, kids' um, sound. Uh, they come with fun stickers so that they can um, personalize, personalize those. <laughs> yeah, um, but all around, they come in four different colors and they are they are really well received by, by our consumers. I know my niece uses them and once we put them on her, we cannot get them off. She just absolutely <laughs> loves them. <laughs> and that and that the product is in addition to the uh, true wireless earbuds that you have as well. Yeah, we've got a huge range um, of true wireless headphones, um, ranging from anywhere from fifty nine ninety five all the way up to about two two ninety nine ninety five, um, with you know increasing um, different feature sets and technology in those. Um, We've got some phenomenal solutions in there. Some of them even util utilizing some Apple Find My Network technology, which is really great. We were able to partner with them on developing those headphones and being the first of their kind as a third party manufacturer to utilize that technology in a pair of true wireless headphones. Yeah, well, I mean, there's a reason you guys are on sale in Apple stores. That's because the products are good. I mean, some of them you can find cheaper clones on eBay or Amazon, but uh, you get what you pay for. That's really the, the simple thing every single time. Absolutely. You know, quality and innovation are at the forefront of everything we do when it comes to manufacturing our products um, and the way that we design them. We really want to make the experience for consumers the most seamless experience with you know build, bringing their technology together into their lifestyle and just bridging that gap between how they use that um so that's what's at the forefront of everything we do so quality is absolutely of the utmost importance as well yeah now uh, you yourself are a bit of a success story because eight years ago you started at belk and you went from an assistant product manager through different product management roles. And of course, now you're the head of product management A and Z. So, uh, you know, tell us, I mean, that's an excellent achievement, but tell us a little bit about that journey. What are some of the, you know, uh, high cool moments you can share and some of the lessons learned that could be of, of useful, of use to other people who want to emulate your success? Yeah, it, it has been an amazing journey. And I have, I've been with Belkin now for eight years, um, as you mentioned, starting as an assistant product manager. And um, I, through that process, have had been really lucky to have people around me that are really supportive of my development, my growth, and obviously my ambitions and goals. Um, you know, that was something that was really amazing for me. Um, one of the, you know, the highlights, I guess, was becoming the head of product management for ANZ, um, but also to see my my team around me achieve their goals and, um, and, and progress in their careers um, with the same uh, support that I was able to get from the business um, in my journey. And, um, and what, what's a very short, sorry to interrupt, I thought it was a natural yeah. break, but what's a very short sort of day in the life of being the head of product management? I mean, have you actually also been able to sort of see any uh, product ideas and thought HQ's got to, got to know there's a need for this sort of thing and, and you've seen it then come to life in a future product? Absolutely. So I, I think to answer your first question around the day in the life of, um, I and very meeting heavy, but I love it because I get to I get to be involved in so many different aspects of what we do on a day to day basis and um, really supporting my team through building and developing their regionalized product category strategies, which is amazing. We we obviously, as we've, we've spoken about, we develop a lot of products um, at a global level, but also we do get to influence what that um, product roadmap looks like at a regional level as well. There's been some really great um, solutions that we've actually brought to market um, in the past that have been driven out of the ANZ region. Um, so it's it's really exciting to be able to influence such a, a, a huge global business um, in that kind of way. You're an influencer too. <laughs> Oh boy. I'll now, take before, it. I'll take it. <laughs> yeah. now, before I ask you about 
uh, the future and what you think it's going to look like and some personal questions. Is there anything else about Belkin that we should know before we move on? Yeah, absolutely. I think something that um, I'm really passionate about and business is really passionate about is sustainability. Um, that's obviously becoming more and more of a, a topical conversation at the moment. Um, and being in the industry that we're in, you know, it's really important that we find more sustainable, more environmentally friendly ways of doing business. Mm. Um, and that is really um, at the forefront of everything we're doing at the moment. Um, so it's it's really great that we can really hone in on that um, and, and work towards being a more sustainable business. So uh, how do you think Belkin will evolve over the next couple of years? Look, I think um, technology in itself is ever changing. And so therefore that, that that's really exciting for Belkin. It means that we, we need to, and we get to be continually innovating and evolving. Um, and to be honest, I think we're just really supported, uh, supporting, making sure that we can um, bridge that gap for consumers um, as, as that technology evolves and we can educate them and take them on that journey of how they can get the most out of um, their technology. So yeah. I think we're going to continue to evolve as, as the world around us does. Um, and while we don't have a crystal ball, we do have 40 years of industry leading experience and a phenomenal team that drives that. So we'll continue to, you know, develop and innovate um, as, as everything around us evolves. Yeah, I was thinking you've got a 40 year legacy of uh, product development and improvements and all the rest. So there's a rich history there. And uh, of course, now being part of the Foxconn family as well, I mean, you've got access to the world's best manufacturing and Foxconn makes a lot of the Apple products. So it's an incredible synergy. And uh, the proof is in the pudding, right? You just go into stores and there's all the Belkin gear there. So as we get towards the end of the interview, I always like to ask a couple of questions about you. And I was wondering if you could please share a memory of your first computer. Yeah, absolutely. Um, so one of my first memories of when I was younger and first using a computer, it was a big PC. Um, and I used to get on there of an afternoon and um, get on MSN chat and talk to all my friends. Um, but one of the other things that really uh, like rings strong for me is the um, dial up internet days yeah. where you had to wait for it to connect. And whenever anyone would get on the phone, it would it would drop you off the internet. So it was it was definitely something that I'm glad we've evolved from. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Oh, those those were. Um... Good memories, but I'm glad they're gone. I mean, I remember when 256 kilobits, which was, you know, five times faster than your 56.6K modem, and they were calling that fraud band. So <laughs> we've come a long way. Absolutely. <laughs> and so, uh, you know, you, you're now the head of product management. What drew you to product management and what drew you to Belkin? Look, I wouldn't actually consider myself a super tech focused person. Um, but one of the reasons that I was really drawn to Belkin in the first place is that I don't really consider them just tech focused. Mm. I really feel that they are lifestyle focused. And it's it's with that that, you know, it, it really drew me to the business in that I felt like I could really contribute and, um, you know, be a part of what that culture looked like. Um, but what I love most about being in this role and being a part of Belkin is, you know, strategizing um, with all of these great teams and people around me, the way that we can bring these amazing solutions to market and just, you know, make people's more lives more seamless um, in the way that they leverage their technology. Yeah. Yeah. And, you know, new gadgets that make your life simpler are really cool. This little Absolutely. iPhone MagSafe <laughs> mount is great. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so my second last question is to ask if you could please share some of the best advice you've received in life to help you get where you are today. I, I think that my advice would be, um, you know, to trust, trust your gut, believe in yourself um, and never shy away from being your uh, own biggest cheerleader. Um, I think it's really important that you know, you uh, are the driver of your own success. Um, yeah. Very good. Yeah. Be the master of your own destiny. <laughs> it's a, if you don't do it, nobody else will. So Correct. what is your final message to ITY viewers and readers and to your current and future customers and partners? Look, I think, you know, in technology, it's always exciting. Um, and as we've mentioned a few times now, 
it's never going to remain still or stagnant. And I think with that ever-changing uh, environment, all I would really like to say is that you can rest assured that Belkin will be there every step of the way to support that journey and, and bring you closer to your technology. Well, Jamie Lang Reese, Head of Product Management Australia and New Zealand at Belkin International, thank you so much for taking the time today and for showing us a couple of cool things and for just sharing your successes. And, you know, I even learned something about Belkin with the, the KVN M, uh, you know, secure situation. I didn't realize that, uh, I mean, I, I knew it was a thing, but I didn't know Belkin did it. So there you go. So I hope we can talk again soon in the future. Absolutely. Thank you so much for having me. It's been a pleasure. Thank you. Bye bye. Cheers. Bye.